Today we will build a Notion habit tracker. I know there are a lot of habits tracker out there, but we will build our own. My name is Vadim, former engineer turned to digital nomad. Now you can follow along to build your own habit tracker and adjust to your own needs. Before we start, we need some rules. We will use only one database and we will not use these ugly buttons. We can do it in two ways. We can completely start from scratch or we can check if they have some templates over there for Notion. If you go over there, click on templates and then personal and we will check habit. Okay, this is our basic foundation. Get this template. Let's eliminate some stuff. I hate these buttons. Boom, gone. Let's check what they have. Beautiful. Can this, this. We have this one. It's very good. Now what we'll do? Adjust to our own needs. All habits. Okay, I, let's delete this let's check what we want to keep we want to keep meditation journaling and running and sleep turn it in codex it's basically a vision board for me i call it codex reading we need something else i do like to stretch we call it we got everything we need let's make some adjustment let's eliminate this emojis now we will give our own style meditation journaling put the pencil codex compass and reading of course book i like this one and stretching people this one all right we don't need to waste all the space if you choose your own icons you can move it like this more compact let's continue to eliminate remove we don't need this one okay now looks for me at least I like this more clean. All right, now we will duplicate it and call it my month. And let's choose beautiful calendar and call it today. Okay, beautiful. Now we need some filters. Let's take a closer view what we have for properties here. Okay, we can keep this, this, okay progress we will fix this later the progress bar uh, it doesn't matter now all right created time we will hide it okay next i need some more property we'll go for text and call exercise i like to track my exercise not with a checkbox i like to write it down what i actually trained today so in my case like running swimming muay thai or lifting i prefer it in this way we tie for example we keep it here beautiful We're making progress in your case it might be something else uh, you can actually define what exercise for you walking 8000 steps could be an exercise we need one more i like to have i call it champion proofs it's from a book the three alert from eric oh i forgot his last name i put a link in the description Basically, it's like daily goals. We will do like wealth or work, it's up to you, which you prefer, and relationships. Next, let's add some filter. The first one is we'll go to created time, and here you can click on these three dots and add advanced filter. And we will to do today. It's today beautiful we will eliminate this one no worries the filter is working we duplicated today that's why we have all these entries all right we will eliminate this later then we need to do some stuff here properties i won't actually see this one and all right then click on the three dots layout and wrap columns we can toggle it out of in all right I want to see if I go to the habit tracker, I don't want to click here open. I want to see everything in one place so I can directly track my stuff. Beautiful. This looks good so far. Okay, I will. One thing I don't need it to see it here. So we'll make it more simple. In the monthly review, we go to the three dots here. And then we will go to group by and create a time. And we will choose by month and newest first it's very nice view so you can see every month in one place or one view let's make some adjustments beautiful this is our daily progress we, we will take care of this soon okay let's select all instead of this and we will 
delete. Okay, beautiful. Now we have this view every let's fix our progress bar here. What we want to do is click on the progress button here or property, uh, added property divided by four. So we have five. Okay, this is the first step. Okay, so at now nothing fancy happened. So you will click on this uh, progress bar formula and then just type to number and choose i think stretching we need stretching right okay done let's check beautiful now this progress bar is completed okay pro tip if you don't like the circle progress bar if you click at property and then you choose yeah for the bar on number up to you really personal preference choose your favorite we are almost there so let's copy this and then if you hover over the here it's new and then click on the arrow down button here and you have like the templates if you click on the three dots here then edit uh, what we want to do we don't want to write every morning health wealth relationship we just put it here and it's it finish and make sure you have this one it mean it's come automatically every day so you can click here on the three dots again and repeat every day and choose your time I'll, for example i wake up at 6 30 let's check out how it looks like we delete this one okay normally in the morning you don't have to click the new button normally the system or the notion automation will do it for you so let's check how it looks like okay we have this one we meditate we write our journal see our vision board we read and we do some lift and champion proofs return push ups friend what i like to do is i reach this goals or champion proofs i basically keep it simple i just open the emojis and yes check it up or i forgot like call my friend so it's like red i can see it if i go later in the month view i can see it directly how many times i reach the daily goal or not i will put template in the description and <laughs> let me know if it's legal i just uh, <laughs> built on notion templates but i think it will be fine so the goal is always to make less clicks as possible of course here you can improve this habit tracker as well uh, i just want to give you some ideas how i would set it up habit tracking is always a good thing to do but be aware of over tracking this happened to me i track almost everything in the evening it took me like 10 or 15 minutes to track every single piece of information i got during the day good question to ask is why you want to track this habit and what you want to improve it's always a goal if you track a habit that you want to improve something thank you so much for watching you can check my latest upload and if you find this video helpful or useful please make sure to subscribe or like let me know in the comments below do you track your habits and what software or tools you use for this tracking see you in the next one